those who've been tuned in with me and welcome to my channel for everyone that's new. Today I want to talk to you guys about some of my summer favorites. Now I know some of the bigger beauty vloggers do like monthly favorites, so like a June favorite, a July favorite, an August favorite, but since I'm a little bit new to this game, I thought it'd be best for me to start off with like my seasonal favorites. So since we're wrapping up summer and we're like walking into fall, finally thank Jesus, I thought it would be nice for me to share with you guys some of my summer favorites. I want to also give the disclaimer that these favorites are probably going to seep their way into uh, the fall and possibly the spring seasons as well, so they're definitely not seasonal even though I kind of got really into them this summer season. So if that's something that you all are interested in, then definitely keep watching. So first I want to talk about household favorites and to start I want to talk about a candle that I've been burning quite religiously. Now I will give the disclaimer on this piece that this is actually like a holiday edition candle. I got this from Bath & Body Works last Christmas. I know, embarrassing that I just started burning it this summer. Um, but it's called Cinnamon Cinnamon Caramel Swirl and when I tell you guys this smells like pancakes and bacon and pie and everything that's right about this world baking all on one Saturday morning. It truly, truly does. So we actually burned this candle in our guest restroom and you can smell it throughout the entire apartment. That's how potent it is and it's just really, really nice in the mornings. I do want to share that this candle scent has actually come back for the past two years. So Bath & Body Works could definitely bring it back come this holiday season. This is the reason why I wanted to put it in this video so that you guys can keep your eyes out for it if it's a candle that you may be interested in. Again, that's called Cinnamon Caramel Swirl by Bath & Body Works. So even though it's a holiday scent, you can really burn this at any time of the year. You could get like me and burn it over the summer or you can do things the right way, even though who does that? And you can burn it during the holiday season. Whatever suits your fancy, definitely put this in with your collection. It smells amazing. And then another household favorite for this summer uh, for me has been my caffeine fix and that's Lipton's green tea and this flavor is super fruit, orange, passion fruit, jasmine. I don't know why all of these things have like super difficultly, difficultly long names. So this one's orange passion fruit jasmine. I used to be like a coffee or a soda girl in the morning time whenever I needed a caffeine fix if I felt like I was really not going to make it through the day. But this summer I actually got on green tea and I actually used to love green tea iced but I hated tea hot. This summer I started trying it hot and it was actually a godsend. This branded flavor actually has zero calories per tea bag, so really the only calories you will be taking in are the calories from either your sugar or your honey or whatever your sweetener is. I actually put both in my tea because I'm a fiend and I need it. I've literally been drinking this every single morning. So if you're looking for a switch up in your caffeine game, definitely get on green tea and Lipton's Orange passion fruit jasmine is amazing. So next I want to switch to some of my favorites for the body this summer. Um, I actually was at the drugstore one trip during the summer and I picked up quite a few things. And one of the things that I picked up was by e.l.f. and it's their lip exfoliator. This exfoliator was only $3 which comes to no surprise since e.l.f. products are typically on the lower end. And this is what it looks like. It's like this brown sugary type color and since it's an exfoliator it has like beads in it and this is a sugar scrub so for some reason this summer my lips have not really been my friend they've been giving me a super hard time um, just drying and peeling and this exfoliator has been my lifesaver you literally rub it on your lips like you would lipstick and then you rinse it off it smells amazing it tastes really, really good, which is nice since this is definitely going on your lips, so you really can't help if some of it like sneaks into your mouth. And it's not toxic to eat, which I wouldn't bite this off, but 
a little taste here and there while you're exfoliating is always cool. So if you're looking for an exfoliator for your lips, definitely don't knock the underdogs because e.l.f. has got this product on the floor. And then um, another product that I wanted to share with you guys for the body that I've been loving this summer is another Bath & Body Works product and it's from their Aromatherapy line and it's their Sleep Lavender Vanilla Sugar Scrub. I use the sugar scrub maybe about once a week this summer and um, I had no idea that the aromatherapy line carried the scrubs, but I'm definitely gonna go pick up quite a few more. It leaves your skin feeling like super exfoliated, super soft. If you do it on a day like after you shave and take taken care of your good your goodies, taking care of your goodies, this will leave your body in the best state you've ever had it. And it's really, really nice to do right before you lay down and go to bed because the scent is aromatherapy and it relaxes you and it puts you in a really nice place. So I've definitely loved the Bath & Body Works Sugar Scrub in Lavender Vanilla Sleep. And this product is still in stores and online, so you can cop this right now. With the scrub came the body cream. So they have a, lo a body lotion and a body cream. I use the body lotion for like my hands if I need it really quickly or if I want to rub like a little bit on my neck. But I use the body cream on like my arms and my legs. I don't ever put anything scented on my face, but this goes really nicely on my arms and my legs. One thing I love about body creams are that, are that they're like really thick in texture. Uh, some people, that's really not their preference. My sisters hate thick lotion, but I love them. I rub them on and it really feels like it like locks in the moisture. And then as I mentioned, this scent is the same as the scrub. It's the lavender vanilla and it's aromatherapy, so it's relaxing. And it just feels really, really nice to lay down after you've like lathered up in this. Some people say thicker lotions like make you stick to your sheets. I have jersey sheets on our bed, so I don't feel sticky after I use this product. I just feel really, really moisturized. So if you're looking for a new body cream that's scented and relaxing, definitely cop the Aromatherapy Sleep product from Bath & Body Works. And this one is still in stock as well. Um, I actually have tried their Aromatherapy Stress aromatherapy stress and that's going to come in like a green color and I've tried the candle and I've tried the lotion and those are really nice as well and I have the hand lotion currently that's energy and it's definitely a more uppity scent that kind of helps bring some life back into you so I stand behind all of their aromatherapy products they are excellent and then lastly, since this is a beauty channel, I definitely want to run you guys through some of my summer favorites in the beauty department. First, I want to start with a mascara that has saved my lashes life. I have very teeny tiny lashes. I always tease my fiance because he was blessed with these gorgeous lashes that he could care less whether or not he had, and I was not. And so this one is by Maybelline, and it's their Lash Sensational Sumpto, Sumpto, Sumpto. It's S-O-M-P-T-U-E-U-X. I'll list it down below because I don't think I'm pronouncing that right. But it comes in a black bottle, and it's got like this rose gold writing on it. And this mascara is bomb.com. I've used quite a few Lash Sensational um, mascaras by Maybelline. But I am absolutely adoring this one, and I can put this on my lashes, just a few coats, and I feel like I'm on top of the world, which is rare when it comes to my lashes if I do not have on falsies. So if you're looking for a really good mascara for both your real lashes and your false lashes, and you don't want to spend a whole bunch of money, definitely try Maybelline's Lash Sensational line and this luscious... Oh, that's what that means. This is in French. So this is Lash Sensational Lushes, is what the English word is. <laughs> you guys, that's funny. Definitely try this, you won't regret it. Um, another beauty product that I've really been into are ColourPop's Ultra Matte Lipsticks. And this color is in Limbo. I'm actually wearing the color today and I've been wearing the color pretty much every day all summer. 
as you can tell it's like a brownish color and I actually really like that I never used to think that I could rock with browns because my skin is brown and I thought it would just be a little bit too much but I am loving this I know some people really only like darker colors on their lips at nighttime but I've been wearing this color day or night and I think it works just perfectly fine. So if you're looking for a brown, definitely try ColourPop's Ultra Matte Lipstick in Limbo. You just put on like one really light layer on your top and your bottom and I've actually eaten and drinking today. Drinking, if that's a past tense word. I've actually had something to eat and drink today and the color is still showing on my lips. That's one thing I really love about these Ultra Mattes. I just swatched that stingray and this is probably going to be on my hand for the rest of the night which is kind of crazy but kind of cool so definitely check out colourpop.com and order some of their lip products i love them so far and then my last beauty product to share with you guys is a contour palette and this one is by black radiance and i am in shade medium to dark this is one of the first contour palettes i've ever bought so that could be a reason why it's one of my favorites one thing that i really love about it is that it comes in three different shades so you'll have your contour shade your sculpting shade and then your highlighting shade this contouring shade is perfect for browner skin tones. I am wearing this contour palette today and as you can see it's like carving out those cheeks extra freaky and I love it. And then this sculpting tone, um, you're actually supposed to place on top of your contour I guess, but I actually use this as an all over face product because it is about the same color as my skin tone so sometimes I'll dip in it to lighten up my contour or sometimes I'll dip it in it to kind of help everything blend really well so there are no harsh lines. And then this highlight is really, really nice too. I'll swatch it for you guys so you can kind of see. It's definitely pigmented. It's not super, super overbearing, but it's subtle and it's nice. I like it. I'll use it on my cheeks. I'll use it on my brown bow, brow bone. I actually just posted a big, or I actually just posted an Instagram photo a few days ago with this highlight on my brow bone, and it was like work. I loved it. One thing I really love about the Black Radiance Contour Palette too is that they actually, if you guys can see this, have like a face, and they show you where each of the products go. I really love beauty products that show you or tell you where you're supposed to apply them like brushes that list this is a powder brush this is a foundation brush and they'll list it on i don't know maybe that's elementary but i appreciate that they help you out where you need it so products like this are always wins in my book so definitely go to blackradiance.com and order some of their products i'm definitely standing behind their contour palette and for those that are a little bit lighter than me they have a light Oh, they have a light to medium palette for you. So that's all the favorites that I have for you guys today. I truly appreciate you coming back by my channel. If there are any other things or products you might want me to try out or want to share with me, definitely send me those way. I'm always taking recommendations. I truly appreciate them when they come. If you guys have tried any of these products and are loving them just like me, definitely shoot me a comment down below. Let me know so we can vibe on the same level. Before you go, I'd also like to ask that you go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Thumbs up this video if you like favorites per season and I'll keep them coming. And once again, I really appreciate you guys stopping by. I will catch you in the next video. Bye guys.